After missing out on Coupe de France glory last weekend, Nice turned their attention back to the league with a home game against Saint-Étienne. Harris came into the match, sat sixth in the table, five points behind the Champions League positions with a game in hand, but aware that a win would take them at least back into the top five, if not fourth, depending on Rennes' results later on. Sante had very different goals, namely just to hold on to their top flight status. All three points here would see them move level with 17th place to Lorient. As the visitors who started the better, we had Budibus finding Denny Buanga. Not this time though. After just 10 minutes, they would open the scoring. The ball played out to Ivan Masson on the right. He fired in with pace. Budibus diverting in via his chest. The goal initially ruled out for offside. Replay showing it was very tight. And after a lengthy VAR check, the goal was given. A potentially huge moment for Pascal Duprat and his side, showing his emotion. It was a doubt for the game after missing the match with Ren through a groin issue, but fit enough to feature and switched on enough to grab the 50th league goal of his career. And late in the first half, it was Levert on the attack again. Budibu's lifting it into the back post and brilliantly volleyed home by Zaidu Yusuf. His first goal of the season in just the second of his career. Not a bad time to find a scoring touch and not a bad way in which to do it. So 2-0 at the break. Some Nice fans taking an early exit, hopefully just for some half-time refreshments. Would Sante hang on? They'd only won three of their 17 away matches this season against fellow relegation candidates Angers, Troyes and Clermont and had failed to win each of their last five on the road, conceding 13 goals in the process. And soon after the break, they will concede their 14th. Amin Guiri playing it to Melvin Barr and the left-back darting into the box and somehow finding the net from an improbable angle. Also just the second goal of his career, a goal not far off both the importance and quality of Yusuf's strike. Speaking of good strikes, Andy Delors with a thunderbolt free kick. Not exactly a knuckleball in terms of technique, but the ball moving in the air, movement and sheer power too much for Bernardoni. And two minutes later, the turnaround would be complete. Justin Clivert released on the right and with the perfect ball and Delors with his second in three minutes to make it 3-2. Both players onside and making no mistake once through. 13 this season now for Delors. Nice would apply salt to the wound, make sure of the result with 10 minutes remaining. Ball from the back flicked on by Delors and substitute Hisham Boudawi with a shot that looped over Bernardoni. A crucial deflection on its way through. But either way, Sante's collapse complete. So 4-2, the final score. Nice keep their hopes of a first visit to Europe's premier competition in 62 years alive. Sante throw away a golden chance to close in on Lorient and must now keep an eye over their shoulder, a mess in 19th.